And I, it's a crowd work show where you're allowed to heckle, so if you're into yelling shit at comedians that already probably have small dicks anyway, give it up for this guy, because he'll be there usually. Give it up for Corey Cacioppo, everybody. Come on, Corey. I actually have a huge dick, Krangus, but thank you. All right. Uh, yeah, my name's Corey. I uh, live in a trailer. I just say that. I don't know. Uh, I'm kind of my mailman's personal trainer. I just order a bunch of heavy stuff, and then I send it back. He hates me, but he's in great shape. So. People say not to put all your eggs in one basket, but fuck that. I don't feel like carrying two baskets. I'm tired. Yeah. Running on fumes. Makes sense though. I was up all night huffing fumes. Makes sense. If you think a picture says a thousand words, you might have it confused with a book. I'm just saying. My friend told me, hey man, if you need anything, my door is always open. So I guess he was raised in a barn. Ha! <laughs> I got you. Uh, I don't know if you guys know this, but giraffes like, are officially on the endangered species list. That's a fact. But like, you'd think that giraffes would have seen that coming. I don't vote, I'm just one person. People are like, talk you into voting. They'd be like, come on, man, like, you gotta vote. What if your one vote makes the difference? I guess it's gonna be a tie. What's lower, what's lower than zero, you know? According to my phone battery, exclamation point. Look it up. I've always been pretty broke, you know? Like, never got to really enjoy a slinky as a kid. We lived in a one-story house. That's rough. When I was little, I used to think a drug addict was someone who does drugs in an attic. Now I realize you can do it anywhere. So that's cool. Look, for real though, end of the day, you shouldn't do drugs. Do them at the beginning of the day, then you're high all day. That's good advice. I tried to do heroin once, I messed up. I used a plastic spoon. So that's good. Went through a rough up a while ago. It was a rough breakup. I was pretty depressed about it. Now you break up with someone, friends choose sides. She got the drug dealer. So. Had to replace two things. <laughs> Try to be a good guy, you know what I'm saying? Walking down the street with a girl, you know? Puddle on the ground. I do the thing, you know, like, take the jacket, you put it over the puddle so the girl can walk through it. She got all mad because it was her jacket. Just thought that counts. Yeah. I was trying to take a negative turn to a positive, you know, like walk into a bathroom, see pubic hair on the toilet seat, treat them like eyelashes, make a wish. You know, like, can't afford a big fish tank, so it's got like the smallest fish possible. That way, he thinks we're rich. He doesn't know what's going on. Being broke has its perks, though. You know, like, I'm in the movie theater with a girl, the movie's about to start, she whispers over, you know, she's like, Hey, did you turn off your phone? I just whisper back, I'm like, It doesn't have service. <laughs> Always been pretty broke. Um, go to Goodwill a lot. Get used stuff. Kind of a stepdad now. So I even have used kids. I learned recently that uh, girls who take birth control can actually still have a baby. Which is weird. Like, if you're taking birth control and you still have a kid, that kid's definitely not going to listen. Uncontrollable. Yeah, I don't really believe in school zones. If you go slow, these kids will never learn. Fucking step on them. I was in the army once, didn't really work out. They, uh, they'd be like, over there, 12 o'clock. I don't know what that means. I have a digital watch. 
Got to rethink my insults. I told my brother I'm going to kill his whole family. <laughs> Wrote an autobiography once. <laughs> Story of my life. I don't really get leaf blowers. It's like, oh, I just blow it over here. Now it's someone else's problem. It's kind of selfish. All right. You guys are not good. I'll say it. All right, my name is Corey Castillo. I'm getting out of here doing a lot of drugs. Thank you. Bye.